Greetings, everyone, and welcome to Bata Seven Nation. So glad and so delighted that you could join us today. So today's focus is going to be on switch emulation, specifically the Yuzu emulator. So it was back in August 10 of 2021 when I did my first Yuzu tutorial. Okay, if you're not seeing this video uh, and you want to install the Yuzu emulator into Batuseta, then I highly encourage you to watch this video first. Okay, this will explain the process. Furthermore, if you install Yuzu while Batuseta 32 was in its beta form and you recently upgraded to the final build of Batuseta 32, then you will need to reinstall the Yuzu emulator once again. Otherwise, it won't work. And in fact, from now on, until Yuzu is officially supported by Batuseta, you will need to reinstall Yuzu every time there is a major upgrade to Batuseta. So again, you will need to repeat the process. And one of those things you need to do, you need to download these files which are found here on archive.org. Here's a zip file right there. It's about one gigabyte. Okay? That's a zip file right there, about one gigabyte. There are no games here or whatsoever, okay? It's just some files you need for Batuseta for it to work, okay? And it turns out that the addition or the revision of the user emulator for this particular download is from August 19, 2021. And it's been almost two months since then, and we have a whole bunch of new revisions for the user emulator. So that's one of the problems with this. You know, if you want to keep it up to date, we got to do this manually ourselves. And in fact, there's some people there from based upon the reviews who are asking the author of these files to go ahead, please update it to the latest edition or the latest revision. Fortunately for us, there really is an easy way, easy solution for us to do this ourselves manually. And I'm going to go ahead and show you that process right now. So first thing is first, you need to go to the Yuzu website. And I will be providing links to all these tabs you see right here. Go into the download section, uh, and then from there, click on manual download. And from there, you can see that we have three different revisions. Go ahead and pick the latest one if you want to. Click on the Penguin, which is Linux version. Click on that, and go ahead and download it. It won't take that long to download, it's about 42.8 megabytes. Okay, once you download it, then you need to rename it, okay? So to rename it, just go ahead and then backspace all this. Just keep it yuzu dot app image, and that's it, okay? Yuzu dot app image. Once you rename it, go ahead and copy this file into a thumb drive or a portable hard drive, uh, and we're going to copy this file into the share folder within Batuseta. So I'm going to go ahead right now. Uh, load up my Batuseta, and we're going to get this baby up and running. All right, so we on Batuseta. And before we copy anything, I want to go ahead and show you the revision of the user emulator I'm using with my Batuseta system, just to show you and confirm that the process works, okay? So first thing is first, let me go ahead and load up this game and show you again the version of the user emulator I'm using. Okay, so right now we're in the main menu right here. Press F11, and from there, you know, you can always go into Alt-E and try to configure things with the emulator as I shared my first tutorial. Sometimes it takes a while for things to load up, uh, but the process does work, okay? And from there, you can just do different things here. I need to change things around, all right? And then you use the tab to navigate around the system, all right? So I want to go into Alt H for help, and then go into About Yuzu. You can see there on the top screen right there. You can see that this revision of the Yuzu emulator is from August 19, 2021. Okay, that is the bill. So let's go ahead now update it, and just go ahead exit like you normally would. All right. Now go ahead press Escape, press F1. And I'm going to go right now to my portable hard drive, go into my switch folder, go into my updates, and there's the file I need to copy, yuzu.appimage. Go ahead and copy, and go into your share folder, 
go into your system folder, go into your switch folder, and right there, you can see there, here's the one from August 19, 2021, and we're going to update it. Just go ahead and paste it, and overwrite, and I'll copy, okay? Now, go ahead and exit, close windows, and we're going to test that out again. All right, go ahead and press F11 again. Go into Alt H, and you can see there we have successfully updated to the latest revision from October 14, 2021. That's it. And we can do that anytime you want to update it. That's how you do it. It's a very simple, easy process. And the reason why we have to do this ourselves is because the user emulator is not supported officially by the Bethesda team. This is something we did on the side, okay? So it's not officially supported by the Bautasetta team. And that's the reason why we need to update it manually ourselves. But the process is quite easy. So we're back on our desktop. And the reason why, because I want to show you what my next tutorial is going to be all about. And this one is due to popular demand, popular request. Scum VM. Funny title if you ask me. So it turns out this is not an emulator. Instead, what they did was that they, they rewrote the game's executables to make it work, all right? So that's going to be my next challenge next time I'm about to set a nation. If you found this video useful, please go ahead and like it. That would really help me out with the YouTube algorithms. If this is your first time watching About to Set a Nation, I highly encourage you to check out our website at aboutthesetanation.com. We have here a section for consoles and also for newcomers. And here you'll see all the consoles I've already done tutorials for, including my latest tutorial, Sega Model 2. Okay? So check us out at aboutthesetanation.com. Once again, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate your time, and I'll see you next time about to set a nation. Bye.